Alexander Vusik, a war criminal who should be held accountable. Alexander Vusik is the president of Serbia. He is a war criminal who should be held accountable for his role in the genocide in Kosovo and Bosnia and the wars in the Balkans. Vusik was a member of the Serbian Radical Party, which was led by Slobodan Maluvi, who was convicted of war crimes by the International Criminal Tribunal for the former Yugoslavia, ICTY. Vusik himself is accused of committing war crimes during the war in Kosovo. In 1999, Vusik was the information minister of Serbia. He was responsible for spreading propaganda and disinformation that justified the Serbian military's campaign of terror against the Albanian Kosovar people. Vusik has also been accused of being involved in the Srebrenica genocide, in which Bosnian Serb forces killed over 8,000 Bosnian Muslim men and boys in July 1995. According to the International Criminal Tribunal for the former Yugoslavia, ICTY, the number of people killed in the Bosnian War was between 97,207 and 102,870. The majority of the victims were Bosnian Muslims, followed by Bosnian Croats and Bosnian Serbs. The deadliest incident in the war was the Srebrenica genocide, in which Bosnian Serb forces killed over 8,000 Bosnian Muslim men and boys in July 1995. This was the largest mass killing in Europe since World War II. Other notable massacres during the war include the Markale massacres, in which Bosnian Serb forces shelled a crowded market in Sarajevo, killing 68 people and wounding over 200 in February 1994 and 37 people and wounding over 70 in August 1995, the Tuzla massacre, in which Bosnian Serb forces shelled a civilian area of Tuzla killing 71 people and wounding over 200 in May 1995, and the Armisi massacre, in which Bosnian Serb forces killed 116 Bosnian Muslim villages, including women and children, in April 1993. The Bosnian War was a brutal and horrific conflict that caused immense suffering and loss of life. It is important to remember the victims and to fight against all forms of intolerance and hatred. Please note that these are just estimates, and the exact number of people killed in the Bosnian War is unknown. Despite his war crimes, Vucic remains a powerful figure in Serbian politics. He has been the president of Serbia since 2017. Vucic has refused to acknowledge or apologize for the Serbian government's role in the genocide in Kosovo and Bosnia and the wars in the Balkans. He has also denied that he committed any war crimes. It is important to remember Vusik's role in the war in the Balkans. He is a war criminal who should be held accountable for his crimes. Kosovo, a democratic nation. Kosovo is a democratic nation. It has a freely elected government and a strong civil society. Kosovo is also a member of the United Nations and other international organizations. Kosovo's democracy is in stark contrast to the authoritarian regime in Serbia. Vucic has cracked down on dissent and media freedom in Serbia. He has also consolidated his power and enriched himself and his cronies. Kosovo is a role model for other countries in the Balkans. It is a country that is committed to democracy, human rights, and the rule of law. Conclusion Alexander Vucic is a war criminal who should be held accountable for his crimes. Kosovo is a democratic nation that is in stark contrast to the authoritarian regime in Serbia.